Okay, so today we're gonna show you a little bit of what goes in the school backpacks, the Rando Seru, that they have to take every day for school and some things that they just occasionally have to take for school. So first off, here's their backpacks. They're very expensive. They get them when they get into first grade. The grandparents buy them, so we milked that one. <laughs> and they last from first grade through sixth grade, so you buy one bag for all six years. The prices of these bags range from $200 to up to about $1,000. <gasps> That's why grandmas buy them. Anyway, okay, so here, first graders always have to wear this, use this yellow thing. So it's very obvious to everyone driving, bicycling, that this is a first grader. So pay extra close attention because they might not quite know what they're doing. This is just a cover. You can buy these covers anywhere. This one's bought from a dollar store. You can buy expensive ones too, I'm sure, but I don't. Just helps protect it a little more. And this cover is the rain cover that you can put on for when it rains. You don't need to. So your bag, you don't need to, but you can. Then also on the outside of their bag is this little emergency. Emergency, can I do it? Can I do it? So if you are being followed or you're being chased or whatever, you can, can pull this it? emergency button. Okay, Anna's gonna pull hers. Wait, no! Get ready to use the iPad. Push it in. <laughs> Very loud. Mine is louder than that. Mine. Can, I Can I do mine? Yours is louder than that? Oh my. Okay, let's try some. I don't do it. Okay, stop. Mine's so loud. My fast. ears are going <laughs> cuckoo. <laughs> and then, so um, loud. here on the side yeah. is where you put one of these. So this is, let me find Sarah's. Wait, mine. You put this little bag right here. What's that called? Napkin eater. What's it called? Napkin bukuro. N napkin bukuro. It's their placemat. So every kid takes theirs, they put it on their table, and they and get he, their this, lunch on top of it. This is napkin, and this thing that you put it in is napkin bukuro. Which yeah. means bag, right? Yes, napkin bag and napkin. So all the kids have these things hanging on the side. Also, every week, of course, everything matches. You have to take your sports clothes. So they have shorts and a regular shirt. Do we gotta wash it? I wash it every week. <laughs> and the red hat. Red and white. It can be white too. It can be white. It's reversible. Hey guys, that quick, quick, quick. Can I do something? So I'm Wait, I'm gonna do something. You can do red and white at the same time. Okay, well it's clean, so don't get it dirty. <laughs> And then also they have their wabakis, which are their indoor shoes. So as soon as they get to school, they take off their shoes, their normal outdoor shoes, and all the kids wear these indoor shoes. We just bought new ones, so they're at school already because school started. So these are all their old ones. We did cool, not cool, but wabakis. What do you think, Anna? Wabakis, cool, not cool? Cool, because it's only made it in Japan. Oh, that's cool. Only in Japan. What about Maybe. you, Sarah? Wabaki's cool, not cool. I think it's kind of cool. Okay, cool. What about you, Becca? Wabaki's, oh, not cool. All right, we got two votes for cool and one vote for not cool. <laughs> okay, that's good. This is a, uh, what's this bag called? Nobody, um, that bag called... It's um, huge. Yeah. What's it called, Sarah? Okay. Uh, okay. Imotsubaku. Nimotsu bagu. Tisage. Anyway, whatever it's called, kids, this they take this to school and it stays at school. Whenever they have to bring stuff home, they bring it home in this. We say down This week, Sarah is Kyushoktoban, so she has to do lunch. So then she has to take this special little hat and wear it. Oh, kawaii! And the school provides a white apron. Then it's Monday through Friday, you're on for a week. Then on Friday they bring it home. They bring home the white apron. Mommy has to wash it and iron it and send it back on Monday. <laughs> <laughs> and you gotta wear a ponytail because if you don't, you can't put it. Yeah. 
Okay, then inside their bags. Ta -ta -ta. There's a couple compartments. And right here, we so usually put their third and a half. This. 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 this is their schedule. And they put all their books in there. This is Sarah's Sonsu, math. Kokugo, Japanese. Oh, they all have a Renakucho Bukuro. No, Renakucho. So, Renakucho. Which they have to write down every day what no, their homework's going to be. This is a Renakucho Bukuro that you put your Renakucho in. And all their homework. In. And right now, of course, we have the temperature thing where you have to take your temperature every day in the morning, at night, and see if you have a cough or sore throat. Which, thankfully, my kids are healthy as a horse. And I, then, I, I, I am. Also, one thing they always have to take is their furebako, which holds their pencils, which is so cute. I wish I had these things when I was a kid. They always have to take a red pencil because they do a lot of correcting of their own. The teacher says, <gasps> oh, I my correct your thing. And then regular black pencils, but normal pencils. And this is the Namaya pen. It's a permanent marker that I'll have to have. An eraser. And then they all have these things. It's the recorder. No, it's not. No, what is it? Kemba harmonica. What is it? Kemba harmonica. Kemba harmonica. Kemba harmonica. What are you doing? What are you doing? You're going to do some music now? Wow. Now in fifth grade, they got these. Yay, sewing kits! Wow. Sewing kits. Awesome. Everything they need for sewing. Of course, you have to put your name on everything. Easy, easy, Not the needles, thankfully. Everything. Thankfully, these girls know how to sew already because Grandma taught them how to sew. Yay, thank you, Grandma. Thank you. Oh, so thank talking about names, see? Her kindergarten, when she graduated, gave her pencil set with her name engraved. Otherwise, mommy has to write their name on it. And then they have this, which is their paint set. Oh, I didn't have that. You haven't gotten this yet. Oh my goodness. Got all their paints and Can paintbrushes. I? Can I see? So this is a thing that you put your brushes in. You can go like this. Tons of paints. Yeah, I want the paint that board that you mix, what is every, this? mix everything in. What is this? That's where you put water in. Oh, this. Cut that. What is that? These are like wood carving. Super, super, super sharp knives. I all sizes. The teacher I cut her hand with that. I cut myself with that. Like These are the different hands. shapes of the knives right there. So the teacher was In case you're wondering. this. Then she, uh, can say, can you hold it please? And she holds it like this. Automatically, goody! Ouch. Then, also... And then also at school they have a set for calligraphy where they do these really, they do calligraphy notes. Oh, really? That's what they do. Rushes. Very one. beautiful. And they also have. Recorder. Oh, they have a recorder. Everyone has a recorder. Oh, and then like they have this thing. So this is a tankenbaku. They carry it when they go on excursions. They can put their papers and pencils in here. Then they sit down. If they're supposed to draw something, they draw on this when they're out in nature or filling out things about excursions. So plus for Asagawa, right? Oh, everybody, let's go enjoy your Asagawa. You put it in there, enjoy it. So that is just a little bit of what goes on inside the Landesel. Landesel! Let's make a Landesel song. Okay, let's put on that heat. Now we in Japan. Landesel! Maybe only in Japan. Maybe only in Japan. Maybe only in Japan. Landesel! Maybe only in Japan. Land the sale! Yay! Okay, I got something now! Yay! Life in 
Japan. Only in Japan. <laughs> <laughs> that was cool, girls. What awesome school bags and stuff. I can have a hat. Oops. Was it, is that for when you're on lunch duty?